Hey, what is going on, everybody? Appreciate you tuning back in. This is going to be a super informative profit trailer and PT feeder video. We're going to go over a ton of different things, but mainly we're going to talk about how to get rid of super deep DCA bags. I just made a video on this and you can go watch it. I don't think it was terrible, but I didn't, I guess I didn't explain it too well. And I'll kind of get into the numbers and go into Binance and show you guys exactly how to do this strategy. But first, um, if you're looking on screen, this, this screen loads so slow. This is ProfitTrailer.com. And the reason I'm bringing this up is because tomorrow, uh, 420, April 20th, Friday, Profit Trailer is launching version two. And so now it's coming with multiple buying strategies. It even says down here, DCA, RSI, Stochastic, MACD. Um, we're still going to have the old trading strategies of EMA, SMA, Bollinger Bands. But you're seeing how this thing is just taking forever to load. And it's because everybody is bum rushing the website to buy their licenses. And the reason for that is I got word that the licenses are, like I said, they're going to subscription model and they're starting tomorrow. All of us are going to be grandfathered in at the pro level. So we're not going to have to pay anything monthly. We're not going to have to pay anything extra. And we're going to get the highest top of the line profit trailer version two when it comes out tomorrow. So there's going to be plenty of videos from me going over how to install it, how to set up the settings, what's new, what's, you know, what are we going to do? Those will be coming out over the weekend. But for now, if you don't have profit trailer, I recommend a hundred percent going and buying it because for one month, it's going to cost you 50 euros for two months or three months. It's going to cost you 130 euros. For six months subscription, it's going to cost you 250 euros. And then a, a one year license will cost you 450 euros. And that is recurring. Like you are not going to get this unlimited license fee again. So I recommend going and getting one of these because they're changing right now. It's at 0 0.03 Bitcoin. I just bought another license when Bitcoin was at like 6,900 because I knew this was coming. And uh, I bought one for Bittrex so I can mess around on another exchange. Um, but that's cool. So I recommend going and getting it now. You have a chance. Now, if Profit Trailer, the website's not loading for you like it is for me because so many freaking people are exploding their website, I'll leave that link in the description. And they are affiliate links, so I appreciate it if you use those because it helps me create more videos and more content for you guys. But if you ProfitTrailer.com doesn't work, go to CryptoProfitBot. I'll leave this link in the description below as well. And you can buy a bunch of stuff. If you don't have Feeder, you can get it here. If you don't have all this stuff, we're actually getting PT Tracker apparently pretty soon on Profit Trailer version two. So you're going to get that as well. If you buy the, the license today, I don't know, guys, I just recommend I had to shill it out there for a second because it's important tomorrow. Everyone's going to be pissed that it's a subscription model and they didn't get in. Whew. All right. Going into DCA and how to get rid of these bags. First things first, you look at these, this says Anderson. Basically what Anderson is, is this is your buying strategy for DCA. Say you had 10 coins and you DCA one time, you would basically buy 10 more coins. You're doubling your bag. Now you DCA a second time you're actually going to buy 20 coins this time because you're doubling your bag. Now you DCA a third time, you're going to buy another 20 coins, right? So, or actually you're going to buy 40 coins. So as you can see, it doubles every time and it gets bigger and bigger and bigger. And that costs a ton of Bitcoin. So the problem is a lot of people are like, Oh, why don't you just keep DCAing at this point? Well, it costs a lot of money when you have 800 coins or you have like, uh, you know, 0.5 Bitcoin in one bag that becomes really expensive. And so this strategy that I'm using, um, kind of Patrick beer, he uses this strategy and he let me use uh, his spreadsheet and I'll leave his link in the description for his discord. He offers this spreadsheet for free, but he calls it the bag dilution strategy. And basically what you're doing is you're essentially DCAing a very small fraction of your bag. And you're not using the Anderson double down DCA sort of deal. And a lot of people are like, you know, why doesn't your DCA work or whatever? And basically I use two very close trigger DCAs. I use a negative three and then a negative five. And then I have a very deep DCA at negative 10. And then I use a stop loss 
at negative 15%. They're like, oh, why don't you just cut your losses and get rid of this bag and let Profit Trailer buy new ones? Well, depending on the market, and I agree that could be a, a good play, but if you can get out of a bag um, profitably, I'd rather do it that way, no matter what the effort or the cost takes. So basically what we're doing with this is we're cutting this 864 total amount of coins that I have. We're going to use this singles and we're going to cut this into a bunch of different parts. And the reason behind this is because if we look at singles on a four hour chart, and this is from a long time ago, say you bought somewhere up in here, this is where you bought purchased singles. You're down negative almost 80% from where you purchased. And that really sucks because you're sitting down here in a negative 80% bag waiting for this thing to skyrocket. But if you look at these candles that you're seeing just in a four hour time frame, you're seeing 28% gains. You're seeing 13% gains on a lot of these candles. And even one like this, which is the most impressive one, this is about three green candles. No, this is one green candle. 166% in one four hour time frame. So profit trailer is actually looking on like the 15 minute, even the five minute candlesticks. And you're still seeing very, very profitable trades that profit trailer can be making. But if you're sitting at a negative 78% DCA, you're literally just holding this and you're just riding it out for the long term. And that is the opposite of what profit trailer is used for. Profit trailer is around so that way you can take advantage of these daily volatility and the daily swings. And so what we're doing with this strategy, if I can find the spreadsheet, is we're breaking up this 864 coin count and we're basically, you, you'll you put in everything in blue, okay? You're gonna enter all this information. So you put in how many? 864. How many price per coin? What did you pay when you bought this? The nice thing about Profit Trailer is it tells you right here, average price that you purchased for. So 00001515, boom, you put it in there and you press enter. It's gonna give you the calculated information. You don't type anything in the green. You type in your loss, so 17.30, okay? Now, how many are you gonna chop this up? How many times do you want this thing to be cut up into? And the more, the better, but the more work it's gonna cost you. So I like to use about 15 times, and what this does is it divides 864 by 15. And what that leaves you with is this number here is 57. So basically what, what we're going to do is we're going to park 806 of our coins into a cell, like into a, a limit cell on Binance. So you'll just simply go to your Binance account and you'll basically sell at whatever price it told you. This is a 1% gain roughly. So this is higher than what you purchased it for. Remember that, okay? So this will go into your pending log and when you park these 806 coins. So you can put it in at 153015. So 153015. And then we're gonna park 806 of these things in there. So what that's gonna do, order submitted, we're done. Now you can go to your open orders and you'll see the ones that I'm actively working on. And these are my limit orders right now. This is the one that just got placed. Okay. So we parked 806 coins in a limit order 1% above where we purchased them. So you didn't sell these. You didn't sell them at a loss. Nothing happened to them. You just diluted your bag. Now you have 57 of these coins sitting actively not in an open order profit trailer cannot touch a pending order which is exactly why we did that so now now that you have this all figured out you've already you put that up in a pending log and that's going to show up in here when profit trailer updates basically profit trailer can't touch these coins but you're still going to have dust of what is this thing called singles 
So if we look in here for singles, it'll probably show up towards the bottom because it's going to be pretty small. But, and it probably hasn't updated yet as well because it takes a little while. But what's going to happen is now you're going to have a little bit of dust in here and it's so minuscule, a small fraction of coin, of Bitcoin, that it's not going to affect what we do next. Okay, and that's where it brings us down to here, diluting. Basically, you're going to type in the number that you want to dilute it by. I like to use 10 roughly. It just depends on how big your bag is that you started with. So let me go back to DCAs. Um, we started with, since this hasn't updated yet, we started with 0 0.01309 Bitcoin. So I like to have roughly my new bag cost about half of what it started with and this is where the numbers kind of come in and you really have to follow so basically if you have if you type in 10 here you're going to dilute this 57.6 and you're going to multiply it by 10 basically and you're going to buy 10 times as many as you already have in your bag so you're going to buy 576 coins and what that is going to cost you is 0 0.0072 bitcoin now you already have 57.6 coins because you didn't sell those. Those are your dust. I hope this is making sense. So basically you now have a new bag resulting in the amount of 633.6 .6 singles coins. And what that is going to allow you to do since you basically diluted it so deep and this 57 coins that you ended up keeping after you parked this in a sell order is so small that you're going to start out in profit trailer this coin will start out at zero it'll it'll show up as a pair and it will be in zero nothing will happen and so basically we can go to open orders at binance we'll go to the exchange and we can buy what was just Go to the freaking thing, 576. So we're going to buy 576 of these bad boys. Okay. And I'm just going to buy it at market price because I really don't care. So it looks like the market price is a little higher now. So order submitted and we're purchased. Let's see if it went through. It hasn't gone through, so we're just waiting. We just wait until that order gets filled and it'll populate in Profit Trailer. And once that happens, that coin singles will be shoved into the pairs log at a 0% gain. It won't be negative anymore. It won't be negative 17.10. Uh, what it's going to do is you diluted it so deep that you now have a new bag, a fresh bag, and now you can take advantage of these upward swings and this is Bitcoin. This is what I'm looking for here. And basically, Profit Trailer will be looking for exactly whatever your settings are telling it to do, right? So it's going to be looking, it's going to have trailing profit on the way up and um, it'll DCA on the way down. And one of the things I want to note in this video is if you don't have enough Bitcoin lying around to purchase these new amount, this 576 you can go to Binance and you can sell this at the market price, okay? And whatever you have, whatever Bitcoin you have after you sell this, you can buy a new amount and it won't always necessarily be diluted by 10, okay? So if, if this is not making sense, I apologize. But say you don't have any Bitcoin right now and you can't afford to park this thing in a pending sell order and because you'll have no Bitcoin to buy this, this new 576 of them. Sell these at a loss, get some Bitcoin out of it, and buy as many new coins as you can with that Bitcoin that you just sold. Okay? If that makes sense, use all of the Bitcoin that you just sold to buy the new coin again. Or if you're some of the commenters down there and you're like, well, screw that, I just want to buy a new coin, that's totally fine. This has just been a really good strategy to help me get out of some really deep bags, negative 60, 70%, and I've profited like 10% off some of these coins. So with that said, guys, get Profit Trailer right now. Go down the link in the description, get Profit Trailer before 
version two comes out and you have to pay monthly. I'll catch you later.